So we go on, more mud larking, low water. This is a nice iron piece. I think that will be the lock of a chimney. Part of a stove. That looks uh, strange. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We go on, mud larking. Very low water. Very rewarding. Nice insulator again. Nice marble again. Yeah, it's a bit frosted. Still, I love it. So that's the fun of very low water. You can go where you can rarely go. And when you pick all the force of clean of marbles, well, down there, maybe more marbles waiting. How is that? So here's again such a square little bottle, no screw top, but I had a couple of these and open lipstick, not my thing, blue marble, some pedestal, <laughs> nice, if it was intact I would take it, see here a glass knob. <laughs> the last knob it is. Yeah, great. Marble. And that will be a glass bead. Sure it is. So we go on. Ooh, that's the marble. It. Just a piece of tubing. Okay, no lipstick. The tubing I recycle. Oh, I see a big marble. You see it. So now it was hidden. <laughs> now I have it. A bit of powder box. What a nice ground this is. And again, very low water. So it's not often I can go here. I see a marble. See it? Oh, I see it too. Again, that will be Merkel oil from a shade coning Tilly, shade coning Tilly, Miracle oil. Very popular 100 years ago. And uh, nice strong bottles. So they survive easily. Small bottles. <laughs> the 
it will be brass, some fitting. Spot here, the white button as well. Always pick these up. Something round, not a marble. There's one. Bright and green. And that's of course a frosted blue one. And here again is a stocking filled with sand and mud by the tides. It's a strange occurrence, but uh, it's what happens. And that's a tiny marble. Yeah, love it. Now what is this bluish glass here? <laughs> Small piece. I'm a bit too optimistic sometimes. See there's wood underneath. And all this uh, brown is round is peat. And it is probably was here. In the time of the Romans, still is. And, uh, parts of it will wash away, erode away. Parts will be uh, uh, here for ages more. Wow! Look at that. That's really a stone marble. Great! Just waiting here. And that's a green one. Oh my, oh my. How marvelous can you go? And you know what? Tomorrow the water will be lower. <laughs> and tomorrow I'll try to visit Seven Minute Island. The edge of Bottle Beach. And who knows what fun that will be. And of course it's always possible uh, there will be nothing at all. Yeah, this wood. Great. Some uh, brass ornament of a clock or a cupboard. Nice thing. So absolutely marvelous today. Oh, that's a pity. Broken in two. Marble. Marble alert. And you know what? Spot another one. Spot another one. Oh dear. I'm afraid all marble records. <laughs> That's another one. <laughs> Will be uh, crushed today. So, how great to have a marvelous adventure. Here's a bottle waiting. Yeah. This is screw top, slightly damaged. Not for me then. So if you see another marble, shout out. They're here today. Oh, that was one probably. Yeah. That's a lovely one. Love it. So, and uh, in a couple of minutes we cross a small creek and uh, go to an area that uh, 
may be very interesting today. I did find a couple of coins there last time. Had them on the camera. You may may not have seen that already. So I'm very anxious to see will there be as much marbles the other side of the creek. Oh man, oh man. Nobody's gonna believe this. Well I'm sorry to say it's true. <laughs> it's true. Man, oh man. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Well, you know, there are days I find hardly a marble, <laughs> and there are days uh, there are marbles around. It's all got to do with the erosion, and this is by far an unbelievable story at the moment. <laughs> so, uh, marvelous, that's all I can say. Most amazing marvelous. <laughs> There's another one. Okay, you know what? I spotted the next one. Yeah. There. <sighs> Short break now. See you soon. <laughs>